All right, hello everybody out there on YouTube. This is 444RR. My first video of the new year. Happy 2011 to you. All right, I got this uh, $5 bill here, this ordinary $5 bill. And I'm going to take this pen and make a little mark right on this $5 bill. So there you see the little mark I've made. It's a little black dot there. You see it right there? It's hard to see, but it's one little black dot. I'm going to take the pen and we are going to, hopefully this will work. Uh, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. We're going to place a little hole right inside the uh, dollar. The pen is mightier than the sword. But all I have to do is just pull it up, and there's no hole in the dollar bill. But this dollar, this $5 bill, I mean, could be counterfeit. Here's how we test to see if it's counterfeit. I put it in the counterfeit detector. Hopefully, well, I don't know what happens if it's counterfeit. I never had a counterfeit bill in here before, so we'll see. Um, and it's... Oops. Um, that shredded the bill. Uh-oh. That was my $5 bill, so I'm out five bucks now. Oh, well, okay. Yeah, that's not very good. Actually, I have to have, I have to give myself a consolation prize. Right here, I've had this box sitting here in plain view the whole time. Probably wondering why it's been sitting here, too, in camera shop. I have a lock on here with a key. It's hard to see the key, but I'm just going to turn the key, and I'm going to unlock the box here. Alright, I'm going to unlock the box, and I'm going to unlock this box I got from TJ Maxx. And inside this box I got from TJ Maxx is a box I got from Bed Bath & Beyond. This is a box I got from Bed Bath & Beyond, and inside this box I got from Bed Bath & Beyond is my consolation prize. It is a box I got from Michael's Craft Store. Yes, this box here I got from Michael's Craft Store. And actually, these boxes really didn't cost me that much. I mean, it wasn't, it's not as expensive as you think to get these boxes. Now, inside the box I got from Michael's Craft Store, we're going to open it up and see what else is in here. And there, oh, it's a box from Walmart. This one I got from Walmart. Okay. And inside the box I got from Walmart is my consolation prize. It is, looks like something's in there, and it's that $5 bill with the pen dot right there. How to get inside the boxes? Well, that's the secret to it. All right, so this is the uh, first video of the new year, and it's called Nesta Boxes. Uh, this is a really cool effect. Now, the problem is you might have seen me do, give away the secret. And I'll tell you why. This is the uh, uh, no assistant Nesta boxes, no magician's assistant. You need to have a spectator to help you with this trick. I don't have one with me, so it was hard for me to do the trick by myself. But uh, you have an assistant, and uh, you know th their object is in here. You can use a five, you can use any denomination of money. You could use a ring, a watch. You could use anything that will fit inside this small box. You can use. Now, I'm not going to give the secret away of how it gets in there, but um, but anything that fits inside this small box, you can use. And it's really cool because the boxes fit inside each other, and it's really neat. So this is the Nesta boxes, and if you want to buy these, Google Nesta, Google, sorry, Google No Assistant Nest of Boxes, and you'll see it's going to be um, uh, Chevette Studios. Uh, David Chevette makes these boxes. They're a little pricey, but um, they're, it's a really cool set of boxes if you do a lot of stage work or children's birthday parties or any sort of birthday party work. You can get them in multicolor like this, or you can get them in black and white, which is just this color. Multicolor or black and white. I like the multicolor. It fits my show a little better than the black and white one, but... This is the No Assistant Nesta Boxes. It's really cool. Uh, I love them. So uh, check it out. No Assistant Nesta Boxes. Google uh, No Assistant Nesta Boxes.